Hey guys, today we're going to talk about sugar, yeast, and candida. A lot of people get um, yeast infections and candida infections, and even other infections from bacteria, even viral infections. And I want to talk about the relationship between sugar and getting an infection. Sugar basically paralyzes your immune system, your white blood cells, specifically the neutrophils, which are the frontline defense against microbes. So you have different types of white blood cells. Neutrophils are the ones that go first and they help defend the body. When you consume sugar, you basically inactivate the neutrophils, you make them sluggish, and then they don't work anymore. So sugar basically increases your susceptibility to getting an infection. So these microbes love sugar. And one example of that would be like a diabetic um, that has high blood sugar. They have a, a greater, greater incidence of having infections uh, more candida, more bacterial infections. If you have these infections and you're still consuming sugar and maybe you're taking different remedies to try to get rid of it, it's not going to work. You have to stop feeding these uh, microbes. So it happens when you have high sugar or even low sugar if you have hypoglycemia because what happens when you eat sugar, you get this spike of insulin and then your blood sugars drop. So you can also get these infections when you have low blood sugar as well. What do you eat? Uh, you can have protein. You can consume vegetables, you can do nuts, you consume fat. And another question that people want to know, can I have apple cider vinegar? Absolutely. Some people are sensitive to it because it's a fermented drink. I find most people can do it successfully without a problem. And lastly, um, make sure you're avoiding the hidden sugars in alcohol, juice, fruit, dates, figs, breads, pasta, cereal, crackers, biscuits, waffles, pancakes and yogurt. And definitely avoid dairy because dairy has lactose, milk sugar, and candida and yeast love milk sugar. All right, thanks for watching. Hey, if you're liking this content, please subscribe now and I will actually keep you updated on future videos.